Now, in other news, the Rural Electrification and Renewable Energy Corporation, RIREC, will spend 15 billion shillings to increase power connections in the country. It says part of the funds will be used in expanding renewable energy technologies, especially biomass, solar, wind, mini hydropower plants. Elsewhere, second hand clothes traders imported clothes worth 1.22 billion shillings in the second quarter of the year, according to quarterly statistics by the Kenyan National Bureau of Statistics. Details in the corporate briefs. The Rural Electrification and Renewable Energy Corporation says it will leverage on the successful implementation of the 54.6 megawatt Garissa solar power plant, which was constructed by the corporation in Garissa County. The 55 megawatts solar park is the largest plant of its kind in the region. The agency will set up 147 small solar plants in off-grid towns to light up homes in Mandera, Garissa. Risa, Turkana, Wajia, Lamu, and Tana River counties. Rerek took over the energy centers that were formerly under the Energy Ministry after President Uhuru Kenyatta assented to the Energy Act of 2019 on March the 14th, 2019. Currently, there are 16 energy centers in several parts of the country mandated to conduct active research on various household and institutional improved cookstoves. This includes training for local artisans in the manufacturing of improved wood and charcoal cook stoves for sale to the general public. Energy is really a very big concern, especially in the rural communities, and we are trying to find out how to help, especially uh, the rural uh, poor communities, uh, to enhance and harness uh, the potential that exists in renewable energy. And Kenyan traders shipped 1.22 billion shillings worth of second-hand clothing in the second quarter of the year as the government banned imports of the item to stop the spread of COVID-19. Data from the Kenya National Bureau of Statistics shows a total of 12.1 thousand tons of mitumba were imported in the April-June period, a 76% drop from the 50,486 tons imported in a similar period a year earlier. The government banned the import of second-hand clothes in mid-March in a bid to contain the spread of coronavirus infections with the order affecting fresh orders only. The ban was lifted mid-August after months of protests by importers. Finally, Cooperative Bank has been named Best Bank in Kenya at this year's African Banking Awards 2020 for the third time having won again in 2018 and 2019. The EMEA Finance Awards recognize financial institutions which, through their client focus and sound leadership, continue to increase profitability, deliver affordable credit to the retail and wholesale market, and support local and transnational corporations do business.